only going to run a wire bills of here, right? Freaking right I am. And my daughter's the cameraman today, aren't you, Mel? <laughs> Freaking right. So she's going to follow me around, and uh, we're going to get this thing up in the air, boys. But the first thing we want to do is we want to loom the old wire, boys. Hey? Eh? Don't we, Mel? <laughs> You're doing a great job. Freaking right you are. Love you, sweetie. How to loom the wire is you stick her in, boys. Stick her in the old gym. Now, if anybody's wondering, this wire here, it came from the old Princess Auto, boys. She's good stuff, she is. So if you ever want wire to just to run a power wire and uh, you don't want to spend a pile of money, then this is the way to go. Freaking right it is. So this is going to take like 20 minutes or so, and we'll uh, get it on. So what I'm doing this for, if you're wondering, I want uh, a power supply over in the old truck Ruski at the back of the tailgate so I can charge the RC cars and stuff. So that will be freaking decent. So we'll get this all loomed up and then we'll be back, eh? One hour later. Well, boys and girls, I finally got the loom on I did, hey? Eh? All right, so we're gonna pop the hood and feed her down through, first of all, before I put her up in the air. Because if I do it the other way, then uh, she'll be dick, boys. So what I wanna do is, I wanna go this way and we'll just let her drop. Maybe. Okay, maybe. There it goes. So we'll go that way and we'll stick her up the front of the truck and we'll put her up in the air. We will. So let's get this thing up. Now, what do you think? Yeah. Okay, go. I'm going to get her my spot. Okay. Decent. Check her out, boys. Always make sure you got everything where you want her, eh? We're good to go. You can go up now. Let me just make sure. Yep, feels good. Up we go! She's be high enough, so bring her down into the locks. There we go. Now she's safe. Pretty great right it is. Pretty cool, eh, Mel? So now we can get under here and actually look and see what's really going on. And I'll tell you what's really going on. Where's the water coming out of? Look! <laughs> Stinks. What stinks? Oh, little bit of ice. Under. We'll get rid of that. Under the trunk. I've never been under the truck. No? She's looking mint. Hey? Look at that. I fed that right down through the control arm I did. What's really going on? So we'll have to pull that back up and around and through. But let me get some gloves on and I'm going to take off the sweater. Hey, you're not supposed to be recording me like that. You're going to do it. If it's a little shaky, I'm sorry. That's all good. All right. So what we want to do is we want to feed this back up and we want to follow the actual wiring harness, which is right there, boys. Ew, water just dripped into my hair. Ew, ew, ew. Frick sakes. Oh, come on, phone. Like and subscribe. Hey, no, I'm at work with the truck and the wife and just run the wire. All right, back door. What we want to do, Mel, is we want to follow all this wire up here. Can you see me? Mm -hmm. Decent. You know what I did? I made this too long. You're going to have to cut that off because that's got this coffin right over. So we want to go through here. Oh, this is so much easier than laying on a driveway. Holy frig. Just don't stand under it, Mel, because you get crap all in your face. Under whale. Just don't stand under me. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I just want to see how much we need. Oh, well, we're going to need quite a bit, boys. How do I pull it out of the loom again? Probably about that much right there now. So, we'll go up here, go through here like so. We're following the stock wiring on this truck, just so you know. Just so you know, we. Decent. Let me get some zip ties. Zip ties. Why wouldn't I? I love you working the camera, Millie. It's awesome. Oh, oh no. We got a zip tie. Around the harness, we do. As we get all sorts of shit in her face. What the hell, man? No wonder why I couldn't see what I was doing when I was doing this at home. Got crap everywhere it does. I know the newer truck looks like this on the unknown side. Uh-huh. Why is the zip tie not working? Holy. Good luck trying to follow me. It's hand Decent. How's that decent? I don't know. This sounds good. All right, boys and girls. I got the wire all ran down the frame I did. And she's definitely due for an oil guard and a frame scrape. So we got a big job ahead of us here, we do. But uh, she's all the way down the frame, follows the original harness, and uh, up the old hole ski. 
as you can't see, and we're gonna come up into the box. Up there we are. So now we gotta get her down off the hoist, we do. I lost my cameraman to a game of X and O's I did. Cause grandpa showed up. Frick sakes. So we're gonna drop her down now, and we're gonna see what's what we are. So we're coming down. Hover on. Decent. Isn't that decent? Yep. So now we get the tail end out and we'll bring the wire up through into the box where I want her, boys. Oh, we got her all ran, we did, and it's through here. See that? Decent. So that's in. And uh, up here, she's at the battery. There it is. So all we gotta do is run a ground back there and hook up power and get my little doodad and whatnots to power everything. My doodad has some whatnots. But I can do all that later, I can. But I just wanted to get on the hoist to get the old wire ran down the frame because it's much easier than laying on the ground, especially in the winter time. Friggin' right it is. Anyways, this is just a short little video here of me running the old wire on the old silver radio at work on the frame. Check out that car, it's pretty decent. Friggin' right it is. That's awesome. It's original, boys. Number matching. First old. Friggin' right it is. Paperwork to prove it. Decent. But, anyways, have a good day. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. And uh, you know what to do for now.